Alright guys, Meg Twin here, getting into the game called SnowRunner. It's a trucking game. I find it quite enjoyable actually. We have to go through a little uh, tutorial before we can actually be free to do what we want here. So let's go ahead and get going. They want us to find a watchtower first. And I do have DLC vehicles for this game, but I'm not going to use any of them during this playthrough. I want to uh, just go vanilla with the uh, trucks that they give us and the upgrades that they provide us. I'm not going to use my uh, Chevrolet Apache for anything. I'm going to go with this one for now and uh, see how far we can get with just uh, what the game intended. Truck isn't bad. Good grief. Yeah, we gotta go through the uh, whole tutorial, kind of gives you the basics of uh, what goes on here. Got water over the road. We don't have a uh, snorkel or uh, raised bed on this thing, so we're gonna have to go ahead and take the detour. I did go through there at one point and uh, hurt my uh, engine. <laughs> Not in this game, but I've done it before and I've hurt my vehicles. Well, that water was a little uh, higher, but it didn't hurt us. We went through it pretty quick. A fuel station over here. We'll go ahead and get that one gallon that we uh, used. You never know, might be one gallon that you need to complete a job. Let's go ahead and uh, go over here and we'll find a watchtower. If I get quiet, that means I'm concentrating. this truck actually. I haven't used it uh, at all in my uh, other game that I have going on this. Alright, now that that music's over with, let's take a look and see where the upgrade is. Up there. I think, um, oh, we have to go, we have to do what they, uh, what they want us to do. <laughs> um, first truck, find the truck. I, I'm ready to rear and to go on my own, but let's finish the tutorial. not want to go through there. That's okay. He's got this. Now, the driver, I mean, we put him through quite a bit, so I think we should name him. Um, let's call him Eddie. Eddie likes all kinds of vehicles. Eddie's quite the motorhead. So we're gonna refer to him as Eddie during this game. Give him a little credit. I don't think he hardly ever gets any during the game. Okay, we found our first truck. Alright, you found your first highway truck truck is designed for roads, so there are no off-road options included. Try not to fall into the swamp or drive into deep mud with it. You can find out more about the different types of trucks in the codex available from the menu. Alright, so we'll stop the engine of the one we're in. We'll go ahead and get in the GMC. 
Good. It's not the best truck for the job, but it'll have to do. The company Steel River Township is waiting for you to repair the bridge. You can find contracts like this one in the map menu. Okay. Okay. Steel River. Old bridge construction. We need to activate it in order for it to show up and track it. Additional markers have... Okay, well, I'm not going to go through all that. Uh, okay, we need to get metal beams. Goodbye, Chevy truck. My little pickup. There's any other trailers around here, is there? We'll keep an eye out for them because you can get uh, experience points from them. Well, there's the lumber mill, and I know taking a right will take me to town, so I'm going to do that. Maybe. <laughs> Eddie don't care what kind of vehicle it is. He'll drive anything. Oh, Eddie. We uh, gave our shocks a good smack. Have to be a, a lot less lead-footed there, Eddie. If you want to keep working. We'll get some metal beams. Watch your sign, Eddie. <laughs> Eddie's going to take advantage of this trailer. Get off of my screen, please. Okay, I think I'm going to have to come in the other way. Tried to keep away from that warehouse sign. Yeah, let me move that back. There. Trailer's too far away. How could it be too far away? Alright, how about that? Damn it. Thank you. Now I'm gonna delete the cargo that's in it. Not mine. That one. And that one. Alright. Now let's get moving. That took a little longer than what I'd hoped for. I 
like how they have cars sitting in a driveway, like people actually are here. Oh, lady! Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sure that's happened before, though. Well, if you can't tell already, we're going to take both loads to the uh, old bridge and get it done in one fell swoop. Shocks on that trailer. trailer. Don't dump your load there, Eddie. Eddie might be a little reckless, but hey, he gets the job done. Ooh, I did not expect that. Won't take the trailer up there either because that will tip. Looking good. Oh, it's raining. Good grief. Because the minute I said it was raining, I could swear I could almost smell rain. Oh, it's raining outside my door, outside my window. <laughs> That's why. Hi. <laughs> That's why I smelled rain. It's raining outside in real life. Jeez. I do remember playing Skyrim at one point. When you get down in those musty, uh, some of the musty caves and whatever you want to call them. I, I swear I could smell that. And no, it wasn't anywhere in real life. got this, Eddie. You're gonna bang this out in one trip. Very cool. Not only that, we're gonna make an extra $3,400 by selling the trailer at the trailer place by the garage when we get there. We're gonna make this old bridge look like new bridge. And playing with the controller, by the way. There's the frame. All right. And here's the rest of it. Check that out. Even paved and painted. Made rank two already. Twenty one hundred bucks. All right. Now we have to find the garage. I know where it's at. Familiar with the map. I do think I need to make it daylight. Did that change?
Well, I guess so. It's just a rainy day. This is afternoon. Looks like on a rainy day. Good lord. I have yet to figure out if a rainy day makes the road, makes the driving worse. Ooh, Eddie. I'm telling you. get through this crap, you're home free, just about. show you. There's a truck out there in the middle of that flooded field. That's going to be a hoot getting out. And, uh, that poor farm, they are flooded to the max. They lost all their hay. Can't do anything with that. I'm sure it's moldy. have a snorkel on this. I don't think this is, yeah, I was going to say, I don't think this is that deep. Feels weird coming way back to the beginning. I'm uh, ranked 14 in my other game. But, I thought some of you might be into something like this. I'm in, I enjoy it. Uh, up until, of course, it gets really aggravating. When you get a, a load about, uh, let's say, nine ten feet from the drop off and and it drops off your vehicle that's not fun okay we got points for those new trailers let me go ahead and uh sell this there we go just made thirty four hundred dollars now let's go to the garage You've discovered your first garage. What you've done so far is the meat of the game. Explore and discover watchtowers, complete contracts to earn rewards, and find garages to improve or buy new vehicles. Now let's get inside. I want to take this uh, upgrade first. Got 100 points for discovering that Fleet Star. That Fleet Star can be a beast once you get it upgraded. Uh, engage is not available for current truck. Okay. Alright, let's go accept that. Ugh, Lord. Now I can go to the global map. Oh, it won't let me. Dang it. Okay. Alright, alright. Let's go to Alaska. Wait a second. Alright, we have to retain this first. All right, retain it with X. Y to go to global. Right button to go to Alaska. Click on the garage. We're almost done with the tutorial. Northport, Alaska. And click on truck storage. Drop your GMC in there. Here's the other vehicles I have. The International Caterpillar that's my Apache six-wheeler 
I got the Wrangler and the Renegade, but I'm not going to use any of these in gameplay in this playthrough because I want to see if you can actually do everything with the vehicles that the game provides you without having to download any uh, download content. So we're here. Let's leave. Okay, welcome to Alaska. Now you know the basics of the game. It's up to you to scout, accept contracts, upgrade, or buy new vehicles, and conquer the wilderness. Completing contracts in Alaska might be tougher because of the weather conditions. If you want to be more prepared, you're free to come back to Michigan and explore Alaska later. Don't forget to scout uncharted areas, discover watchtowers, and run contracts from the map menu. Okay. All right, let's recover because we don't want to be here right now. For some reason, my uh, D-pad doesn't want to bring up the menu that quick. Okay, we'll recover. Um, Okay, I want to retain it. Why aren't you letting me, uh, truck storage? What? Okay, oh, I had to read that thing before it would let me do what I wanted to do. Good lord. Alright, let's go back to Michigan. Go back to the garage. Okay, put that in there. I'm going to go to the map. Black River. I'm going to select the Fleet Star. And we're going to put that in the garage. Good deal. And... Did we get, uh, no, that wasn't for this. What did we get out there? I didn't even see what, uh, vehicle it was for. Maybe, okay, rear, rear wheel, ooh, and, okay, that was it. All right, so we got that on there. Let me go back to the map, and let's get in our Chevrolet. Okay. Now, let's take a look, see if maybe we can go ahead and get that upgrade over here. Okay, I will mark this. Now, I didn't say to go there. I know how to get everywhere on the main roads, basically, but uh, some of these other ones. Let's see. Let's go. Well, I guess we'll go. This way. up there. Let's see if we can do that. You know what? I don't know what kind of tires he has on it. Well, he seemed to be doing pretty good, so let's just see if he can make it. Yes, the lumber yard looks like a best place to get those planks. We're already done with that. <laughs> oh, no you don't.
da. Eddie says, I'm not doing all this zigzagging crap. <laughs> Just get me to the point. Well, we're going to pick up a couple gallons because we have some more exploring to do. Stop myself from sneezing. Good grief. Okay, now let's go back and go up that road up there. Don't hit the tanks. You don't want to blow the town up. Haven't changed the tires on this. I don't know if we can, but so far it seems to be doing pretty good. Let's see if we can't get that first upgrade. See what that's all about. just rain so we're running over wet grass and whatnot. And they, they do have a ton of DLCs for this game. If you're interested in playing it, they have a ton of stuff. Uh, it's really fun. Okay, we gotta go back this way. like he's struggling. Oh, we're here already. Aha, raised bed. Available for current truck. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead and put that on. Let's recover him to the garage. And go ahead and raise the bed. Oh, suspension. Jeez, I was looking and I was like, where is it? There we go. Oh, we do have all terrain open. We got seventy-two fifty for money. Um, now you see how I'm going through all these highway ones, and some of them are cost more than others. But if you look at the wheel performance, it doesn't change at all. The only thing you're actually changing is the visual of the tire. So I always prefer to spend less money. I don't care what they look like. Now these are a little different the all-terrain it does change the wheel performance but sometimes it doesn't so you really need to take a look at it and uh, I think I want to go with average average and good 31 though average good average These are average, good average. They cost the same, and they're 35 inches. What about these? Same. All right, I'm gonna get those. Okay, an off-road doesn't unlock until rank four. All right, let's leave the garage. I don't know how long this video is gonna be. I'm not gonna pressure myself to worry about the length. Um, 
In my opinion, that's what the pause button's for. If you're tired of watching, just give it a pause and come back to it when you're when you're ready. That's what I do with long videos. Um Okay, let's get a plan going here. Alright, so we're here and we have a tower right here by our by the farm. So we'll come out here. Almost up to the farm entrance. And we'll go up here. Okay. Sounds like a plan to me. Some big old tires on there. Hope that doesn't set his uh, center of gravity up too high. Man, dude, you're booking. Holy Moses. Oh, we didn't get a snorkel, guys. Can we afford a snorkel? Sorry about that. I need to see. 2300. We have 4950. Why not? All right. Okay, now we can go. You're all set, Eddie. For high water and whatever else you can get into. We'll get all those watchtowers uncovered at some point. And then uh, after I do that, I'm going to start on fixing all the bridges. It makes it a lot easier to do some of the jobs if all the roads are passable. Less headache. Take a left here, buddy. I forgot to look and make sure this was going to take us right by the tower. Pretty sure it does. When I get up to a point where I know I can... Uh, stop without sinking into the ground. Alright, we just keep going. Why does that look like we can go a lot of different ways? I'm going to go ahead and mark this. Cause that almost looked like we could take another route and I don't want to screw up. Okay. Oh, that was just a runoff from the mountain. Ho, ho, ho. That was pretty gnarly. Oh, I forgot to change the color of his truck. That's alright, I'll do that later. My uh, theme for my uh, truck team for his trucks is going to be olive green because it looks really nice on these vehicles. Okay, we got an upgrade. Yep. All right, let's see. Oh, that's right down there. 
Okay, so we got to turn around, we got to go back, and we'll go here. Oh, it's going to do it anyway. That's okay. Oh, yeah, this is across the old bridge. Ooh. Hey. <laughs> okay, camera. I gotta be be able to see. Great. Now I got the hiccups. Popped her in the low to get around that weird area. All right, we're good. Good, good deal. Let's go get this other upgrade. Jeez, Eddie. <laughs> uh, wrong way, buddy. gallons of gas we're doing pretty good Ooh, be careful on here you don't want to drive off the bridge not available for current truck show truck list GMC that's what we have back at the uh, garage okay well, let me uh, shut the motor off, save some fuel, and see what we got on the map. Um, we could come back out and get that. That's the end of that one. This one... Oh, well, let's see. Yeah, I think we're going to come back. We'll backtrack here. Oh, I hope that goes to it and not all willy-nilly. road. <laughs> I don't want to go off either side. Good job, Eddie. When he sleeps, he feels like a ping pong ball being thrown back and forth. Go 
go ahead and take this job. Not gonna accept. I mean, I'm gonna accept the job, but I'm not gonna track it just yet. Okay. Get some more points. Yep, thirty more points. Fuel carrier trailer. Ho ho ho. Don't think so. Yeah, there's a truck out there in the distance. Right straight ahead of him, you can see it. That's another job. But I don't want to get stuck out there, so I'm not going to go out and get it. I don't know if we can do this. Oh, there's the tower right there. Now, well, Eddie, you don't seem to be worried. Speed up the process by using the winch. How come it's not connecting on that one out there? <laughs> I guess it don't connect the bushes. Now, do I have to go? Yeah. Alright. I guess it's better if we follow the road. I'm probably sinking as we speak. Ooh. That tree is all shredded at the end. That looks pretty cool. See it. Okay, we've got objectives on this one. Usually they show upgrades first if you're going to get an upgrade. Okay, we can come back out this way. Uh, and head over there. I guess we'll go this way. I gotta mark it otherwise some uh some areas might look like they're a road and they're not where I wanna be. Okay, daylight, where are you? Alright. Okay, so we just go forward. Oh, he was sinking too. You don't want to sit there too long. You will sink down in. Oh, 
his low gear works pretty good too. Good grief. Why did I decide to go this way? Ah, we'll make it. We'll make it. This will be the last watchtower we do. I got some stuff I gotta do today. Okay, back on the road. I wish I could break it and make it disappear, but it probably would just show back up. Like those barricades up there by the fuel tank. Even if you go through them the first time, they're always there. It annoys the heck out of me. I think if you uh, move them once, they should stay deleted. Or they should just, you know, disappear. But no, they're there every time. And you gotta break through them every time you go that way. Take a left. Oh, well, this truck isn't too bad. Not too bad at all. <gasps> Ooh, Eddie, that was close. Let's go through this. Thank God for these blue marks because I wouldn't know right offhand. Chevy's a pretty good climber. Better than what I was actually expecting. I hadn't played with this particular vehicle in quite some time. That's it. Okay. That's it. Alright, I am going to recover back to the garage. And in the next episode, we'll get their remaining... What do we got? If you scroll down here on the left-hand side... Okay, we got three... We got four watchtowers left. We got these three, and then that one over there. Okay. And we didn't uncover any more upgrades, but we will as soon as we get these four towers. So stay tuned. Hope you enjoy it. And I'll catch you next time. Bye-bye.